Hey guys, welcome to my uh, first Let's Play Chess series. <laughs> Jesus. Yes, I'm making a Let's Play Chess series. Um, hold on. Alright, so basically, um, I'm not really that good. I'm not a novice. I'd say I'm an amateur. My rating is about between 14 to 1600. It really depends. Um, my playing style really differs um so yeah it i guess it, it's just like i have on and off days with chess really but um okay this is the problem i don't really know how to um stop this but yeah so any of you guys have any tips for me i would be greatly appreciated um this <laughs> You probably yeah, this is probably not the best move. This is probably actually a really bad move. I don't know how to play this variation very well. Actually you can still push down that pawn. Ugh. It's a lost cause. I'm canceling it. So yeah, basically I'm I'm an alright player. I can get by. But um I prefer playing white, to be honest. I'm still in the middle of you know, learning all these opening moves. I well I know quite a few, but I've never really studied them too much. I just kind of like playing chess for fun, but uh, I really love the game and I I really want to start taking it a little bit more seriously now. So, I'm going to start studying more openings and attack lines and whatnot. So, hopefully, you know, that'll be more okay. Is that a legit? I've never seen that before. That's interesting. I really that doesn't seem it doesn't I don't I don't see any reason why the queen would do that unless maybe trying to push down this pawn here which seems kind of ridiculous but all right if that's what you want I'll just push up this pawn here hopefully you know <sighs> he opened to the outside he already knows that if he d moved it there I was going to just push it up anyway um but opening on the outside, like, I would usually open up all my other pieces and kind of wait and see how the position plays out myself. But, um, I say we should start attacking, although he can defend. Um, it's always good to keep threats, though. That's what I hear all the time. <coughs> Pro <coughs> Problem is he can push down this. Um, D, uh, D5, I believe. And takes with the pawn takes um you know take back but then he could uh position seems a little weird i could always retreat it i'll i'll see how it goes we'll see how it goes um i'm going to risk it yeah did exactly as i predicted all right maybe you'll do something with this e pawn i don't know let's find out but I don't really like, you know, doesn't seem that worthy. I mean, gaining space, I guess, but. <sighs> that queen looks very tasty right now. I think I might go for an attack. But the question is how? I'm not sure. Um, I know this is kind of bad because, you know, usually you don't get. You don't get commentaries from people who are amateurs, but I kind of did it because I liked, I just felt like doing it and I felt like it was something I enjoyed and I have a good passion, very, um, you know, I'd say, yeah, interesting passion for <laughs> chess. I love the game. It's a very beautiful game and I really think it's been underestimated recently. I mean, I go to my high school not nobody really knows how to play and it's really a shame because it's just such a beautiful game and you know people just keep playing games like I don't know video games like Call of Duty and stuff and you know I just really think this game is underestimated but um please don't get mad <laughs> if I blunder cuz I'm <laughs> probably going to blunder quite a bit in this um, but I think it's c it'll be kind of interesting for you guys to see me kind of progress. I'm wondering if I should take this, but then there'll be immediate threat on my queen. I mean, my bishop, but then. Alright. 
Um, I'm gonna try it because this is a semi-open file, and I'll be up, I'll be up in Material. So, all right, here we go. Now maybe possibly this. Actually, I, that probably would have been best first. That probably would have been a more aggressive move. Maybe I don't know. Um. Okay, so now he's trying to attack it. Push it back a little bit. Um, I'll just go for this. Oh, I see why he moved the knight outside now. He wanted to protect this square. See, still there are many other options. You could have just, you could have just played e6. There, are, you know, maybe put the queen here somewhere. There are many other options. I think that's probably like the worst thing you could do, in my opinion, at least. So, we know he's going to retreat his queen. The question is, where? Oh, and for those of you who are wondering what this is, this is uh, this site is called instantchess.com. I love it because there's no registering or signing up or any of that stuff. And it seems pretty, you know, it's alright. Um, you, you can, you play quite a bit of, like, it's, it, it's not really... Uh, dependent on your rating or ranking or whatever. It's kind of random, so that's the problem, I guess. But uh, that's actually wide open. So I'm going to go ahead and take advantage of that, I think. Looks like I have some good attacking opportunities. Um, sorry, if <laughs> I apologize again if this isn't the best move. Like I said, I'm still, you know, learning. I've only played this game. I've only played chess about, I'd say, a, a week. I mean, not a week. So what am I talking about? A year. So about a little over a year. Okay. So I was thinking about pushing this up here. No, wait. The knight. Oh, man. Take back with the knight. Okay. Either way, he loses in the exchange because he loses the ability to castle. So, I think I should go for it. I think I should go for an exchange. Then he's a pawn up. Hmm. <coughs> yeah. Well, actually, he should probably take back. Yeah, okay. Now I have an opportunity to defend the pawn. But I really don't know... <sighs> what I should defend it with or maybe I should just push it up I don't know this is uh, maybe here attacking the rook making him move I don't really think there are any good squares these don't really seem like very good files for attack in my opinion maybe this one maybe uh, the C file but I'm protecting that with my queen um I don't really know. You could probably move the knight there. No, that's stupid. Uh I don't see um any kind of immediate attack on my queen if I move here. You could force an exchange on queens, I guess. Um I'd be more than happy to oblige, I guess. Where was I originally? Hmm. This is this is a bit tricky now because Maybe I should. Hmm. What if I check the king? Oh, I don't know. Seems a bit pointless. I don't know. <sighs> hmm. I wonder where the heel go. I can go here. Hmm. Yeah, many options. Uh, glitched out again. I think it was. Was it here? Was it there? I think it was. Yeah, he moved up there. Um, that's a pretty good spot. Actually, wait, that's a bad spot. That's a fork, I think. 
and he can't block with anything. Ouch. Alright, looks like I pretty much win this. He may as well go ahead and resign. I don't see how he can fight back. Yeah. Is there a reason for that? Okay. He's probably going to resign. Nope. Interesting. <coughs> Quite interesting. Um. I think I'll protect this pawn at the same time as the blocking the check. Maybe move this knight out here and then push this pawn up. Gain some space and, you know, make the queen dance around the board. Okay. So. Don't know why he moved the. Oh, he's going for an attack on the the rook hmm I wanna go for I like to you know this looks like a very good um square right here too bad I can't get there immediately um actually what if I push it up and then attack the queen no it's alright this is probably the best defense um, I don't really like defending too much, but I was planning on castling queenside. Uh, uh, the problem with me is I don't really know when to castle kingside or queenside. I always prefer castling queenside because it takes one less move to centralize your rooks. Um, so okay, so he's pushing down, probably trying to get rid of this defender of the pawn. He's still, he's still hell bent on the pawn. I mean, <coughs> yeah. Even if he does take it, I can just take back with my pawn, and then I'll defend it anyway. I don't really see. I guess he just ran out of ideas, and maybe he wants to exchange. I always hear that bishops are better than knights, and knights are better bishops, or whatever. I guess it depends on the situation. If he goes here, he'll protect this square anyway. Um, if I take back and he doesn't move the queen, he loses his queen, so he's gonna have to do something about that. Check. And, um, well, I'm kind of running low on time, so maybe now isn't the best, um, opportunity. I should probably figure it out as I go along. Oh, wait, he's probably doing, gonna do something about the bishop over there. Um,. I just hope I don't blunder. I need to have more faith in myself. I think this is okay. It's okay. I'll just take back with the pawn and protect this. Move the knight here. Dangerous threat. And, um, yeah. Let's see what he does. He's probably going to take it anyway. Or maybe he'll do something else. Maybe he'll. I don't know. Oh, surprise, surprise. And still not going to do anything. If he doesn't decide to take that, he checks. I can just, if he takes with the knight, then I'll just take back. Takes, I'll take with the king. Also, that's a check, and he pretty much loses his queen. So it's game over. There's no way. He lost a rook, and I assume it's a he. It might be a she. I don't know. But uh, he lost a rook and a queen, so. I, although he is up in time, but I really don't think that matters too much. Uh, he, he fought a good fight. He's like, he's, is he actually planning on playing? Or can he even go? think here oh, I keep doing that now I don't know where he is I think the king is he's just gonna get checked again 
I can't see better. Uh, is that a possible checkmate? Wait. Okay, so the king is there. I don't really think that's a checkmate. Mm. No. Not really. He can just. Okay, I'll just take the. I'll just go for the simple solution. <coughs> and take with the. Wait, that might. My, I, I see. I think I saw a checkmate there, but it was hard to see because. Uh, the king glitched. Alright, so he resigned, so that was an interesting chess match. Hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, please, by all means, give me some tips, feedback, you know, say and move so and so. You could have done this or that. I'd really appreciate all the help I can get, and hopefully, we can grow together as, you know, chess players. For all the beginners out there, maybe, you know, you guys can get helped out you know by my games maybe my games will help you out a bit but I would really recommend you actually just watch Grandmaster <coughs> games uh, the better they are the more educational I think but I guess sometimes it's hard to find um, the reasons why they do some moves so maybe maybe um, this is actually more better uh, better I, sh I should say um, for the at least the beginner level because it's kind of compliable with you know um, you know beginner level thinking of tactics and stuff it's the one notch above but still I think you guys can kind of understand why I do certain moves and stuff and um, so I hope you enjoyed and um, yeah please be sure to comment rate and subscribe and I'll see you guys later bye for now